is wide open. What up, yo? What up, yo? Hey, um, my name's Nellie Osborne. I'm from Seattle, Washington. Nellie Osborne? Yeah, buddy. Fucking awesome name. <laughs> yeah, people think so. Do they have Seahawks up there? <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> and they, they shit on people, too. You know. <laughs> It's okay. <laughs> All right, so my question for you is... No. Well, you just chill your roll, man. Hold on. <laughs> She's right. <laughs> All right, um, what is the most awkward request you received in your career? <laughs> Give me a good one. I got a request to um, come to a prom. They said, our kids are going to go out drinking, but if you would come to the prom, then all the kids would show up at the prom and they wouldn't go drinking. It was really weird. <laughs> oh, man. And my neighbors at Clarkson, Michigan sent me um, a letter. They go, when you first moved in, like we were really scared. <laughs> and they go... But you know what, you have turned out to be a nice neighbor and we want to bring you a six pack of Coors Light and a bunk cake to say welcome to the neighborhood. <laughs> That's awesome. Hey, thank you. You're welcome. You have fun. True story. I got it, I'm... Of course. Hi, Bobby. Hi. Sherry from Detroit, Michigan. Keep spreading the joy. That's what I do. Yeah, absolutely. Anyway, I saw you and Joe Dirt. Hilarious. Would you ever consider... Life's a garden. Dig it. <laughs> Would you ever consider doing any more movies? I hate movies. Hey. I don't, I don't want to be an actor. Well, thank you. Because I'm a singer. <laughs> thank you, Bobby. God bless you. Uh, I'm Val, and I'm from Saginaw, Michigan. I was born Saginaw, Michigan. Going to both of the shows. Um, I'm also representing my woodshop crew pals. Brought them along with me. And my question is, we are excited that you are doing a couple of shows with Bob Seger this tour. <laughs> my favorite Seger tune is heavy music. What is yours? You know, the thing people don't realize about Bob Seger is he can sing like Tina Turner. But he's a male. But he can sing like Tina Turner. There's a church house, gin house, a little schoolhouse, our house. Highway number 19, where people keep the city clean. They call Nap Bush. And, and Mike Turner's like, Nap Bush, Nap Bush. I don't know if that answers your question. Not Bush City Limits then? <laughs> I am, ex I am beyond excited to be able to sing with my musical hero and mentor, Bob Seger. There's nothing cooler, there's nothing cooler in America. Like, you have Heartland singers. You have John Mellencamp, Tom Petty, Bruce Springsteen. Fucking Bob Seger blows them all away. In my humble opinion. Pretty good for a country guy. Hi, Kid Rock. Hi. My name is BJ, and I'm from the home of Amendment 64, Denver, Colorado. What's your real name? <laughs> I'll tell you later. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a four-time cruiser. <laughs> Next week, when I get out of rehab, I'll let you know how I survived it. <laughs> Are you serious? I am. You can do rehab in a week? That sounds great. I'm on the fast track. <laughs> Thank you. Kid Rock, I'd like to know how we can make this as memorable an experience for you as it has been for all Show of us. Show us your boobs. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. I'm, I'm just, hey, I'm just serious. Everybody BJ, else has. Man. BJ, I was riding that boat over from the island the other day. This girl's like, check out my boobs. I'm like, awesome. 
<laughs> My name is BJ, so I have something better to show you. <laughs> Don't threaten me with a good time. Thank you, I love you. God bless you. No boobs? Bobby. My name is Rosanna Bucci from Nutley, New Jersey. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just serious. Um, do you have any superstitions or lucky charms no. that you follow or keep? No. No, nothing. No, people always ask, like, you know, like do you have like a superstition about that? I'm like, no. Nope. Nothing you do before a show? Nothing. nothing. We say a prayer. Before we go on stage, Jessica likes to pray. We thank God for giving us this life and these people and playing music for people, and that's what we do. That's it. Yeah. Right, thank you. This is America. We speak American here. Hey, Bobby. I'm Lynn from Chicago. Thanks for number four. It's been great. So here's my question. If you were an athlete, instead Michael of... Michael Jordan. A, a what? Michael Jordan! <laughs> if you were an athlete instead of a rock star, would you rather score the winning touchdown for the Lions in Super Bowl, for the Super Bowl, or the winning goal to clinch the cup with the Red Wings? So this has nothing to do with your question, but Kenny Chesney calls my dad after my dad had four bypasses and had prostate cancer, and... He wasn't doing good, and Kenny goes, hey, I want to call your dad and, and check on him. And Kenny calls me back after, he goes, your dad's the funniest motherfucker on earth. I'm like, what did he say to you? He goes, he goes, Kenny goes, so Mr. Richie, are you gonna like, maybe take up tennis? Or, because he, all he does is, he's retired, he bothers my mom all day long, that's all he does. And he goes, he goes, um, he goes, he goes, have you heard about this Tiger Woods guy? If I knew that shit was going on, I would have started golfing a long time ago. <laughs> Pretty funny, right? Yeah. yeah. So what's your answer? <laughs> what? Can you repeat can you repeat the question? <laughs> okay, my question was, would you rather score the winning uh, the winning touchdown for the Lions during Super Bowl or get the winning goal for the Stanley Cup with the Red Wings. Winning goal. That's what I guessed. Hockey. Thank you. Go Blackhawks. <laughs> you say go Blackhawks? They won like 27 games in a row. <laughs> Fucking Chicago. Hi, Bobby. Hi. My name is Jamie. I'm from LaPorte, Indiana. Of course you are. <laughs> I'm a three-peat, and my question is, what is your DVR set to record? Duck Dynasty. <laughs> you know what that show's about, right? It's not about rednecks. It's about family. They say a prayer, and they eat together every night. It's about family. It's true. Salut Bobby, mon nom c'est José de Montréal, Canada. Ma macchiato. Ma question est après quatre croisières avec nous, quelle est ton meilleure expérience puis qu'est-ce que t'aimes pas? What you call me? Okay, I'll go for English then. This being your fourth chilling the most cruise, tell me what it is. Where are you from? Montreal, Canada. Well, it's America. We speak American here. <laughs> I'm just kidding. That was funny, right? <laughs> I love you anyway. Too. I love you too. That was funny though, right? <laughs> so tell me what is your favorite part of this, and is there anything you don't like about the cruise? No. And what's your favorite part? It's it's a big fucked up family. It's awesome. Everybody tells me they go, 
I, I ran into so-and-so, I ran into so-and-so, and they were so nice. Yeah. You can't buy cool. Thank you, merci. But if it comes available, I'll be able to afford a whole lot of that shit. I'll just... Hi, I'm uh, Michelle McAdams. I'm from. Are there any guys on the boat? <laughs> None that can spell enough to write a question. I guess. <laughs> I'm from North Atlanta, and um. <laughs> First, I want to say thank you for letting us what, have What's the city? Coming. You had never heard of it. <laughs> anyway, no offense. Thanks for having this awesome vacation for me and my family. Um, my question is, how much input yes. do you have in your schedule and what you keep for your tour? What? How much input do you have in your schedule? Planning it, what songs you sing? I'm very important. What'd you say? <laughs> I didn't hear that. Input. How much input do you have in planning your schedule? Did you say input? Because <laughs> it sounds like you might be from Georgia. <laughs> um, everything's on my shoulders. You help everything? I told him, I go, did you guys see the flip-flops and the towels? They're cheap as fuck. And... When we were coming on, I had them sent to me in my house, and I go, this is some cheap ass shit, and they want to sell them for $25. I go, why would you fucking nickel and dime people? They paid $1,000 to come on a cruise, and you're going to fucking nickel and dime them over bullshit. I'm like, no. Thank you. Know. Thank you so much for looking like, out for us. Why would you nickel and dime them? Thank you, Bobby! Thank you. Don't I don't know if that was your question. <laughs> Bullshit. You can hey, buy Bob. the same flip flop to Bass Pro for ten dollars, and they're gonna sell them for twenty five. I'm like, why are you gonna rip people off for what? They paid a thousand dollars. You're gonna fucking nickel and dime them? Go fuck yourself. No, no, he, he's not talking about us. What was the question? Oh yeah, here we go. Hey, Bob. Hey, Junior. Um, three feet cruiser here, Kristen. Go to bed. <laughs> the full circle, okay, Bobby. so I'm a three time cruiser. My name's Kristen from Trenton, Michigan. Down river. Down river. That being said, you filmed the music video for Let's Ride. McCloud Steel Mill. You got it. My grandparents, everybody in my family retired from McCloud. My dad used to work at Detroit Steel. Nice. All right. So you filmed that music video in my neck of the woods, still live there in Trenton. It kind of helped. It's, it's added another piece to why that song is special to me. Is there any song or songs that you're in concert performing that hold a special meaning to you? Did I upset you? No. You just confused me. <laughs> They all mean something special. I'm a songwriter. I try to make people feel things that I feel, and apparently it's working pretty fucking well. Is that being cocky? Not at all. Not at all. I just want to really quickly say thank you to you and the Twisted Brown Trucker on behalf of this dysfunctional family you've got. <laughs> We appreciate everything that you and the band do for us. God bless you. Thank you. There's no guys on this cruise, right? It's been all girls questions. Hey, Bob. I'm Brandy from San Angelo, Texas. And Woo! Yeah. I love 
Joe Dirt just because you say my name throughout the movie. That brandy? Yeah! And I'm not so sure that Def Leppard sucks either. But... <laughs> not either. Everyone has a hidden talent of some kind. I used to make money off my husband in college by shotgun contests. Is he a pimp? Yes. That's he funny, was. right? By a shotgun contest with beer. We know your awesome musical talents, but what hidden talent do you have that would shock us? Zoe. I don't hide any of my talents. I put them on display for the whole world to see, and I generally enjoy it. Thank you, Bob. But I'm really good at antique. I like to antique. So do I. It doesn't scream American badass, but. It's pretty cool. Don't tell anyone. You'll blow my cover. Now right, we got three more, Bob. Three? Are there any guys? Is yeah, the last one's a dude. I promise. We just dragged him out of the hot tub. We have no idea what he's gonna say. But we don't care either. Fucking shit. Hey, I've been watching that TV all day with all the pictures on the cruise, and the guy with the pink bikini. It should say underneath his, underneath his pink bikini gives zero fucks. <laughs> Zero. Ready? That's, Hi, fu that's fucking funny, by the way. Hi. Hi. I'm Ann from I'm Oakland, Bob. California. I'm from Detroit. <laughs> and, yes. And I, and I started reading about your foundation that you started in Michigan. So I was wondering what it is that you've done so far and try, what are your plans to help people, for 2013? Funny? <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. I just help people, that's it. He's a humble man. He's a humble antiquing man. If you were me, you'd do the same thing. Yes. I'll try. Hi, I'm Sonia Vaughn. From Northern California, also. Eureka? Yay! Really? I nailed it? Eureka, California? No? Sorry. <laughs> Colby. Not too far from Oakland. I, I just turned 75 years young in. Bless Florida. your heart. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing here? <laughs> No, no, no. Having fun, right? And this is my third cruise. <laughs> Thanks to my daughter and son-in-law, Mark and Karn. Thanks, Mark and Karn. I'd like to know, how does it feel seeing us oldies rocking out with you it's on a little the cruise weird. or at your concert? It's... It's... Beautiful! It's entertaining <laughs> at its best. Because when you come to one of my shows, like look around this boat. Whether you like the music or not, it's fucking great people watching, right? Yes, absolutely. And we all make that happen for each other. We are we are like being cordially different for each other. <laughs> Batman Speedo, like, woo! <laughs> it's generally cool. Does thank that answer you. your question or no? Yes, thank you very God much. God bless your heart. I love you. I love you more. And please welcome the only dude on the boat. Dad! <laughs> What's up, Rock? 
Um, I'm, I'm Jane from Cincinnati, this Ohio. This is why we don't have guys ask questions. <laughs> I wanted to know when we can expect to hear about the next rock cruise. <laughs> Yo, Nick. What's up? What's up? We <laughs> chilling the most? Chilling the most. Buy a yacht with a flag show and chilling the most. Rock that bitch up and down the coast. <laughs> <laughs> What's the question? <laughs> when can we expect to hear about the next Chill in the Rock, Chill in the Most cruise? Dang. Are you in a rap band? No, I need to be. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck yeah, you do. <laughs> Is that Paradigm's dad? <laughs> I'm just serious. Um, what was the question? <laughs> When's the next cruise? Next year. <laughs> Thank you. How, how much good music is on this cruise? Have you seen Lucas Nelson? Shooter Jennings, the band of Heathens, Trombone Shorty. It's fucking unbelievable. Make some noise! What's the, what's the question? <laughs> put me last so you can make fun of me. Where are you from? Cincinnati, Ohio. You sound like you're from Louisville. Right no? Here, baby. See that? Cincinnati Reds. I'm fucking drunk. <laughs> Every year I do this, I'm fucking shit-faced. <laughs> Let's get shit-faced. Let's get into trouble. I can't, I can't even hit the right note. We don't care. All right, hey, Bob, that's our last question, but on behalf of myself and everyone in Six Man, thank you. Hey, You're fuck you, man. Andy. You got it. <laughs> hey, all you guys, let's have a great night. Give it up for your captain, Kid Rock. I heard you jumped in the hot tub without your top. You're the only black girl on the boat. You're like, woo! <laughs> uh, Y'all have a great night. All right, Bob, let's do it. We're good. Hey, fuck you, Andy. That's your service, Bob. This That's is America. We speak American. You goddamn right. <laughs> Mic drop. <laughs> Right.